Hey everybody, it's Brittany Saturn. And I'm Ryan Belcher. And, and welcome, welome to, to Forest, Forest Life. Life. I'm take off this wetsuit. Yeah, you don't need that wetsuit on. So I made the terrible mistake of accepting this petition. Oh, yes. Yes, I can throw it away now. Yay, throw it away. So I had this petition uh, where somebody wanted me to go to another town. It was peaches. And I was like, I'm not going to another town right now. But it won't let you get rid of the paper for like a couple of days. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and then I'm going to go up here and they're going to charge me for it. Yep. I don't have a trash can. No, a they, trash can. they can just charge you for it. It's not like we're made of bells over here. That's true, but... I just want to throw it away in the trash can. Okay. I thought we had a trash can. I think at one point we did, but I don't think I, I don't think I have it anymore because okay. I think I was intending to make like a kitchen, but okay. I never did. So it's cool. I'm just gonna buy some flowers. All right. Well, while she buys some flowers, I'm gonna get into the nitty gritty of this episode, and we're gonna talk about national days because we got some serious topics to talk about today uh -oh. and by serious i mean seriously fun oh, okay Whew. and by seriously fun i mean one of them seriously fun <laughs> <laughs> but no Oops. seriously fun <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, i'm on the edge of my seat over here <laughs> every day is a national something day and today is no exception Brittany. hmm Let's get right into the fun. All right, let's get right into the fun. Will you stop saying fun? <laughs> Serious fun. <laughs> no, today is National Cat Day. Oh, okay, I thought you were about to say it's National Fun Day. <laughs> <laughs> about to hit you. <laughs> oh, man, there was a fun day. I should have led up to that, though, like a few months ago. <laughs> should have could have, would have. I know. Should have. Um, I kind of like casually have every national day memorized now. Yeah, that's what I was saying yesterday that I'm never going to remind you of national days because you're the keeper of the national days now. So well, tell us about cat day. <clears throat> this day was founded to help public the public recognize the number of cats that need to be rescued. The day also encourages cat lovers to celebrate the cat in their lives for the unconditional <laughs> love and companionship they bestow upon them. Are you checking up over there? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I don't know. If, if you're a cat owner, you'll know that your cat loves you as far as you plan on feeding it. <laughs> nuh -uh. I'm Our cats love us. Okay. They love us even though, like, we feed them. They love us in spite of that. <laughs> in spite of that. <laughs> I mean... Despite that. <laughs> In spite of it, they'd rather not eat. Yeah. The devil's lettuce. <laughs> Pretty good morning, we're having, wouldn't you say? Blaze it. Uh, if oh you're new God. to the show, Stitches is our stoner character. <laughs> 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 yeah, let's just talk to him. Yeah, nice days like to have picnics outside, eat some lunch, take a nap. That, yeah. I think that's pretty much what I do at home anyway, but doing it outside makes it feel special. That's right. I love Stitches. Yeah, me too. It's a little creepy haunted well, <laughs> here. <laughs> so, Brittany, uh, if you could, just, like, not, don't think about our two cats, because we have two cats. Uh, if you could have any kind of, like, any breed of cat, what kind of cat would you have? Um, so, I think, like, Himalayans are really pretty. Uh-huh. Uh, but I also think a hairless cat would be really fun, uh, because so, they're so weird looking. They are very weird looking. <laughs> And it's kind of like the thing that makes cats cute is their fur. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But hairless cats are like, they're so ugly, they're cute to me. Uh huh. So I think a hairless cat would be really interesting. Also, I'd be curious to see the difference in like cleaning. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> I sweep and vacuum up a lot of hair. Uh, we have two cats. Uh, they're not long haired cats, but they're Frank? like. Medium. Sometimes. No, he's not considered he's not. long hair. He's, they're just like regular, like short hair. I know, hair I know. I've had a long haired cat, but these cats are bushy as fuck. They're not that bushy, Brian. Compared to. What's the matter with you over there? I'm sorry, I thought. <laughs> you jumped back like there was a spider on you. No, there was a, I thought there was a cat doing something. What is this? Look at this little. Look at that like... son of a bitch. <laughs> Yeah, the fossils have nowhere to go because mm -hmm. I have flowers pretty much covering every bit. I love it. There are a few places that don't have um, flowers, but I love we're going to fix that in the next couple of days. <laughs> ah, ah, motherland. Let's get every flower we can. Well, Brittany, that's not the only thing we got to celebrate today. Okay. Today is also... I know you're going to get really excited, so get ready, okay? Okay. 
You, you, I don't want you to. This is so much anticipation. Okay. Okay. National Oatmeal Day. Oatmeal Day. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god, oatmeal. Oh. <laughs> so, uh, if you didn't catch it, uh, it Brittany really doesn't care about oatmeal day. Um, I like oatmeal. Oatmeal's oh, alright. I don't think it deserves a day. I mean, you know, <laughs> there's a lot of things that don't deserve a day. Well, but, tell us about oatmeal. Who invented oatmeal? <laughs> <laughs> oatmeal has a long tradition in the state of Vermont, which originated within the Scottish settlement. And although there were many variations, most oatmeal recipes began with steel-cut oats. The oats were soaked overnight in cold water, salt, and maple syrup. And early the next morning, the cook would add ground nutmeg, ground cinnamon, and occasionally ground ginger. And the pot was placed over heat and cooked for approximately 90 minutes. The oatmeal was served steaming hot with cream, milk, or butter. Well, now you all know how to make oatmeal. <laughs> <laughs> yep, they did give me like a who made oatmeal, but the problem was it was like it was really hard to explain because there's a debate over who oh, made oatmeal. They're fighting over who made oatmeal. Yeah, so there's like I don't know. It's just uh, did, did you want me to spend five minutes on oatmeal? Because well, then I could have explained you, it. You are actually because you're explaining about how you're not going to explain. I about so far two minutes. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now we're gonna have to make a, like the opposite of stitches for our last day because stitch is outside enjoying his day unlike his normal habits of being a hermit which would be perfect to celebrate today which is national hermit day national hermit day that's right so today is the day to spend some time alone uh, it is a time to step away from the hustle and bustle of your everyday life and retreat to someplace quiet so, Brittany and I like to do... No. No. Are we confirming it? No, nah, we could do something else. What you well, do okay. That? So, the reason why I t said I would change it is because he was... The, like, only option to tell him no was, like, basically to disappoint him. Mm -hmm. It wasn't the option to say, like, hey, you're great. Keep it like that. Mm -hmm. It was, like, sorry, I can't help you. So, we can just, just confirm move, it again. Just put an exclamation point on it. Let's make it... Let's make it even crazier. Boom. That's right. So, like, it would, you know. That's right, pop star. Because <laughs> I love that he's he does blaze it. <laughs> blaze it! So, yeah, let's just keep I also that. love that he just wears an America shirt now. Yeah, so that was, like, a thing I made, I think, 4th of July. Uh-huh. Yeah, I just never it. changed it. Hey, Sprinkle, let's talk to Sprinkle. You're looking so you today, B-Star. What do you want to talk about? Frappy. Frappy. Got something delivered to me that should have gone to someone else. I was um, happy at first, the prize gift, right? But then I saw it was ready for Bangle. Why is it, she getting now all the things? I'm just too bummed things. to take it over to her place. I'll take care of it. Actually, right. I actually haven't talked to Bangle in a little while. Let's so. go talk to Bangle. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, while you're talking to Bangle, I'm going to do something else. We're going to talk about them other bees, them birthdays. Mother bees. Them mother bees get that bee all up in that shit. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. Half the I time, don't know Brittany. what you're saying either, Brittany. I'm just, I'm just a lost soul. You're a lost, lonely lost soul. in these soul. All these birthdays. All these birthdays. And if it's your birthday today, happy birthday! Happy birthday! <laughs> <laughs> oh <fun>. man. <laughs> All right. Well, I only have two birthdays today, but they're both fantastic. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. So we're, we're, we're you know, short but sweet. First and foremost, we got Renona Ryder. Renona Ryder. Renona Ryder. Robber, robber. Perfect. <laughs> she turns 47 years old today, born in 1971. She had her breakthrough role as a teenager playing Lydia Dietz in the 1988 film, Tim, uh, Tim Burton film, Beetlejuice. Uh, she then went on to play prominent roles in such films as Mermaids, Edward Scissorhands, Bram Stoker's Dracula, Little Women, and Girl Interrupted. She also stars on the Netflix steer, uh, series Stranger Things. Fun fact, I thought that was going to start today. <laughs> yeah, so Brian was telling I me a lot of and this. all of our friends, like, oh yeah, they're making Stranger Things season three. It comes out on the 28th 
uh, or the 27th or something like that. And he was just like, or 29th, I don't know, I don't know what that is. I said 27th. But he was like telling people it was coming out and get us all excited. I was excited. I went on Netflix because obviously if it was going to be on Netflix, it would be like in the banner, you know, they'd mm. be like, what's out? Like, ah. Yeah, yeah. It's uh, one of their big shows. Yeah, and I hadn't seen anything about it. And then I went and Googled it, and it was like, we don't know when it's going to be out. Look like It looks like 2019 in the summer, and I was very I was, disappointed. I was, <laughs> I was distraught. That being said, <laughs> we are watching two shows right now. Yeah. Yeah, pretty cool, but they don't have Renona Ryder in them. No, they don't. <laughs> so, but no, we're watching, we watched one episode of that new Sabrina series. Yeah, the Chili Adventures of Sabrina. And that seems really cool. Yeah, that seems really cool. I never watched the original. I watched a couple of episodes, um, literally like a couple months ago. Yeah. And because it's such an old show, I was like, I can't really get into this. It's it is so way hard. too, it, like, corny for two me. 90s. Two 90s, too corny, which is fine if you like that and you grew up with it or whatever, but I just couldn't get into it now uh, i want to like it i love all the out of context clips i see from it especially salem being super sassy mm -hmm. um but i saw that they were remaking it and it's actually i think a lot darker a lot more serious but uh it seems really cool i like it and the other <clears throat> thing we're watching is uh castlevania castlevania so i've already seen season one but Brittany hatton so i'm re-watching it. it with her right now it's only four episodes so i'm really excited already, to like, get into the new stuff. Uh -huh. yeah, sorry, we still okay. got like two more episodes to watch. That's okay. We can knock them out together. We can yeah. watch that tonight. Actually, we need to get into more spooky movies because Halloween is fucking upon us. It, it sure is. I think Halloween night we should watch Halloween. Yeah, <laughs> I agree. Because you have been bugging me about that all month, all month, and we just have not been able to sit down and actually do it. So let's do it. Well, you know who I'd love to be sitting down and watching these movies with. Me. <laughs> not just you. Our next birthday. <laughs> Which we can't because he's dead. It's Bob Ross. Bob Ross. Bob Ross. I'd love to watch scary movies with Bob Ross. I don't think Bob Ross would put up with scary movies. <laughs> he would just be like, oh. He'd probably be like really into the artistic integrity of everything happening on yeah. screen. So that'd be funny. No, he probably was secretly like a huge horror fan. Well, he was in the military for a long time. Well, that doesn't mean that he likes horror. No, but like... <laughs> You're he in the military. Be, he he loves be, blood and guts. <laughs> he had to be mean, though, because he was yeah. a drill sergeant. Was he a drill sergeant? Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, that's not it, though. We still got one more birthday, and that's Rodeo the Bull. Rodeo the Bull. Yeah, that's right. That's, that's weird. <laughs> that, yep. Well, Rodeo likes historical things and red things. But <laughs> <laughs> I would say that he doesn't like red things. But nothing flashy. He's just constantly in his house, like, red <laughs> with his face. Hey, there's Bengal. Hey, Bengal. And Bengal wants to talk to me. If I could, like, not yeah, yeah, water yeah. the flowers. <laughs> came up with so an idea. Came, Ooh. came up with an idea to increase the livability of our humble town. Oh, boy. Uh -oh. Here we go. <laughs> oh. A metal bench. Great idea, right? Yeah, sure, Bengal. God damn it, Bengal. Thanks. I thought I was gonna be able to do one more like really cool. That would've been like awesome if they if she gave like us like some cool a great national national monument. A national monument. <laughs> <laughs> You're so used to saying National Day. Uh, You're yeah. like a national. I had to like t uh, like oh shit. I've already <laughs> gone too far. Too far. Yes. Open it. Uh oh. A spade tea. Sorry, I went through that so fast. I think I got the spade tea. You did. Oh well. <laughs> cool. Well, guys, thank Alrighty, you so well. much for hanging out with us. I think we're like around. Oh, we're, okay. Where, where are you? Where are you huffing to? I don't know. To this bench, I guess. To sit down. Okay. Well, guys, <laughs> thank you so much for hanging out with us. We'll see you again tomorrow for another episode of Forest Life. Bye, everyone. Bye.